Hey, I'm Robbie with Category 5 Technology TV, and tonight we're looking at a magnificent device from Brother, and this is the MFC 6490CW All-in-One Multifunction Center for Small to Medium Businesses. This is a professional series all-in-one device, uh, so we're talking about a built-in fax machine, built-in camera card reader, photo printer, photocopier that's color uh, granted, and nice thing about the photocopier printing uh, aspects of this device imagine this it prints and scans at up to 11 by 17 uh, so if you're used to a device that's only going to print in legal size this is going to go one step further and be able to print at full ledger size uh, so that's amazing now on top of that uh, if you've got a wireless network at uh, at your office or in your home office uh, you're able to connect this puppy in using WPA, w, uh, WEP. You're able to get this right on your wireless network. So there's no cables going into this printer other than the one that's going into the power outlet. Of course, it does have the ability to be plugged into both LAN as well as USB or uh, just one or the other. But again, if you've got the wireless, you might as well take advantage of the fact that you can basically put this anywhere in the office where it's within wireless range. And you'll be able to both print and scan, use the fax machine using PC fax software. Uh, you'll be able to use that right through your wireless network to the MFC 6490CW. Now with a device of this magnitude, I'm not going to be able to show you absolutely every device, uh, every feature of the device. There's things like an automatic sheet feeder, for example, which we just, you know, we can't get into that. But you know what it does, and you know that it's just an awesome thing to have in business if you've got to put long documents in and multiple pages. But what I do want to put uh, focus on tonight is the fact that we've got the 11 by 17 print and scanning. So let's take a look at uh, this sheet here. This sheet shows us uh, two 8.5 by 11 sheets of paper side by side printed on the MFC 6490 at 11 by 17. So we're basically getting double the size of a regular letter size piece of paper. What does that mean to your business? If you've ever printed a spreadsheet on 8.5 by 11, you'd probably try to set it to landscape and things still get cut off and so we got to leave out fields and especially when I'm doing accounting and things like that, printing out business reports, I often have that problem. Now check this out at 11 by 17. It's amazing how much stuff you're able to fit on this one spreadsheet printout on one single page. Perfect if you're going to be doing a, uh, a presentation to a client or a uh, possible investor in your business, uh, or of course if you just want to keep accurate records. Now this of course will fold directly in half to a perfect 8.5 by 11 sheet of paper fit in a normal, uh, a normal document folder. So that's very, very cool. On top of that, of course, being 11 by 17, both in the scanner and the printer, uh, you're able to print uh, color photocopies. So we can run off copies of that uh, at 11 by 17. Absolutely phenomenal. Now, of course, we're not limited to only 11 by 17. We're able to put anything up to that, basically, into this printer. There are two document trays. So the top tray is able to work with not only our standard document formats up to uh, letter and legal size, but also, in addition to that, we're able to put in uh, documents like uh, 4 by 6 uh, photo paper, for example, so that we can print directly from our camera card. Um, so we're going to actually try that just to show you exactly how, e you know, the ease of use of this printer. I absolutely love it. You've walked into uh, your grocery store or your local super center and you've used that kiosk where you just pop your camera card in and it spews out a picture. And that's, you know, that's the way things are with digital media these days. It's absolutely awesome. But imagine having that kiosk ability right at home. And that's what I love about this printer. Uh, one of the many things I love about this printer is the fact that it has not just the built-in camera card reader, but also it includes a built-in 3.3-inch uh, color LCD display. So you're able to actually bring up your photos from the camera card, scroll through, and print them. So let's give that a go right now. I've actually got my camera right here. Um, so I'm just going to pull the car card out of here just to show you how simple this is. And regardless of whether you're using this for business or for personal use, um, how nice is this? Now, I mentioned before that the, the trays, we've got two trays. Um, so what I've done here is I've got 8.5 by 11 sheets of paper in the bottom tray, and I've got my 4 by 6 photo paper uh, in the top tray. And I'm leaving it like that uh, on a permanent basis. So anytime I want to print 4 by 6 photos, I don't have to change paper or anything like that. That's the beauty of having two trays. I'm just going to take this card here and just insert it directly into my camera card slot. This is directly out of my camera. I'm just going to pop that directly into the slot, and you're going to see that this puppy's just going to come alive. There we go. So as soon as that's inserted, you're going to see that uh, everything comes right up on the screen. You can view your photos, print an index of your photos on a standard piece of paper so that you can see them on there. Um, we can print photos, enhance your photos, which is another feature of the standard kiosk system, which is really nice. And there's other features here as well. But what we're going to do is just print this to a 4x6. So I'm just going to go view photos first. I want to bring it up on my screen. And I've just uh, placed a photo of uh, my wife and son on there uh, on that camera card. So I'm going to select how many copies of that photo that I would like. Um, so all I have to do there is just use the up or down arrow. And you can see I can go two copies or one copy. 
and things like that. And if you've got multiple prints that you'd like to go through, you can actually scroll through them right here on the screen. So from there, all I have to do is just hit OK, and then it's going to ask us for the uh, print quality. I'm going to say it's a photograph, and then paper type. You can use other glossy as the default, but I'm going to actually change that to Brother BP71, which is the high-end Brother photo printing paper, which I use. Uh, and then there's uh, different features, like you can adjust the brightness and contrast and things like that, add true to life, but I'm going to actually just leave everything default just so that you can see the quality of this printer uh, just by leaving everything but the paper type as default. So then I press OK, uh, and then, pardon me, and then I press the start for color, uh, color print directly to uh, that photo printer, and you can see that it's going to start sending that directly to the printer.